I'm the father. <laughs> Papa, Daddykins, Dada. <laughs> Did you hear me? Did you? Nah, you didn't hear me. Nobody ever hears me. It's a story of my life. Nobody ever listens to me. Have you noticed that at all? Have you seen it here? Am I just making it up? Nobody ever knows I'm around. Nobody, ever. My own parents even didn't notice me. One day I went to school. When I came home, they'd moved. <laughs> If someone stood up in a crowd, raised his voice up way out loud, waved his arm and shook his leg, you'd notice him. If someone in a movie show yelled, fire in the second row, this whole place is a powder keg, you'd notice him. And even without clucking like a hen, Everyone gets noticed now and then Unless, of course, that person it should be Invisible, inconsequential Me Cellophane, Mr. Cellophane Should have been my name Mr. Cellophane Cause you can look right through me, walk right by me, and never know I'm there. I tell you, Cellophane, Mr. Cellophane, should have been my name, Mr. Cellophane, cause you can look right through me, walk right by me. Look, uh, Andy, I'm afraid I gotta hit you hard. I, I can only hope you'll be big about it. Amos. My name is Amos. Who said it wasn't? It, it's uh, the kid's name I'm thinking about. What kid? Roxy's kid. You know when she's due? Early fall. September. Can you count? September. That means you couldn't possibly be the... But I want you to hand out these cigars anyway. I don't want you to give a damn when people... When people what? Laugh. Laugh? Why should they laugh? Because they can count. Here's a copy of Roxy's first statement. It says you two hadn't copulated in four months prior to the, uh, the, uh, incident. Well, that's true. We ain't done no, uh, copulating in four months. Early fall now. Wait a minute. But I, I want you to forget about all about that. Well, my client needs your support. Hold it. Wait a minute. That don't figure out right. I couldn't be the father. Divorce her? Is that what you say? My God, man, you wouldn't <laughs> divorce her over a little thing like that, would you? You're damn right. I'll divorce her. That's what I'll do. I'll divorce her. You probably wouldn't even notice. Suppose you was a little cat residing in a person's flat who fed your fish and scratched your ear. You'd notice him. Suppose you was a woman wed and sleeping in a double bed beside one man for seven years. 
you'd notice him. A human being's made of more than air. With all this bulk, you're bound to see him there. Unless that human being next to you is unimpressive, undistinguished, you know. Much of your time. <laughs>